not proud of it. When we first got here, things were bad. Real bad. It was all too easy to start scapegoating the initiative. When the revolt happened, I joined. But things aren't better on Kadara. Or out there on your own. Thanks to Vetra, I got a second chance to do things right. I wish I knew what he was talking about. Tell me more about Meriwether. She used to be some kind of military surveyor. Now, she's a gang leader and smuggler. Working for her was all right at first. Then, uh, she started doing things we didn't agree with. But you don't just quit working for Meriwether. We needed someone to help hide us. Now, Meriwether's convinced we're scheming against her, or something. You said Vetra helped you. How exactly? Some of us were trying to get off Kadara. She must have heard about it through contacts. She reached out to us, made up assignments at the outposts. That got us free. We didn't meet her in person. Only over comms. Maybe it was never really her. You think? Anyway, we thought Meriwether would let us go. We were wrong. Do you know what Meriwether plans to do with us? We were always bait for Vetra. Now that Vetra's here, Meriwether has no use for us. And for Vetra, most likely revenge. Meriwether doesn't care for people who meddle in her business. Nothing good in store for anyone, I'm certain. There'll be time to talk later. I knew Meriwether was going to find us. I knew it. We need to talk. Yeah, I know. These people here think I helped them, and somehow Meriwether feels screwed over by it. You sure you don't know anything about what happened here? Ryder, I swear on my sister's life. I don't know what I did to put myself in Meriwether's crosshairs. How well do you know Meriwether? I've heard of her. A smuggler, not affiliated with either the outcasts or Collective. Never did business with her myself. Kind of a loose cannon from what I've heard. What do you think Meriwether's planning? Looks like she was gunning for me. Use the people she thinks I helped as bait. If you ask me, she's planning to kill me. After a thorough interrogation, of course. Sounds like she wasn't expecting you. Might try to get something out of the Nexus in exchange. We'll talk later. Focus on getting out of here. What I like to hear. Door controls are not accessible from here, Pathfinder. There has to be a way out. I can open the doors from my end, but they're powered down. We need to get them going again. Your end? Who are you? I don't like the sound of this, Ryder. Just get those doors some power! It appears functional. No way to know until we try. That cable's not going to get power to that door.
I'm directing security cam footage to that panel. You'll be able to see the guards coming. If you wait till they go by, you could surprise them. Are they gone? Is it safe? They didn't see you. Stay here. We'll take care of them. The ventilation in this place is awful! Everything smells like spit bug! Don't worry about it. Just try not to get killed. Care of it. We should check that the colonists are okay. Is everyone okay? Sidera Nix, you've been pretending to be me, haven't you? Uh, how did you think I don't recognize my own tricks and stop using my voice? Sorry, it was just easier to get things done when people thought I was you. You know, because you have contacts and stuff. Sid. So you didn't help us, just like you said. It was... Yeah, my kid's sister. Give your sister some credit, Vetra. This wasn't exactly easy to pull off. Ryder, don't encourage her. Sid, I know you're in the facility somewhere. Get back in your shuttle and return to the Nexus. But I can help you get everyone out of here. You hacked a door without checking for safeguards. That's help we don't need. So walk me through it. I got eyes on the base. Ryder? If she can tell us what we're up against, that'll be a big help. See? Fine. But she has to follow my instructions. Can you do that, Sid? Yes, Vetra. We'll stay put and follow you when it's safe. Don't want to get caught in the crossfire. The sooner we get going, the better. Sid will alert us if anything's headed our way. Head down the corridor, through the mess hall. That's quickest. Before we go farther, are you in a safe spot? Yeah, I'm tapped into their system from outside. Shuttle's well hidden. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Sid. Sid, we're going to need you to hack into systems to cause a disruption. Right. Only one. Get in and get out. Too much messing around and they'll track you down. I can send a surge of power to that generator. The electrical discharge from that could take out some of them.
Ryder? Overload that generator as I walk through the door. You got it. Get in here now, Sid? It's manually locked down. I can't open it from where I am. What the hell is happening? Who's messing with security? Why are the feeds down? Someone answer me! That's a lot of animals. They could be training them as a security measure. If they're still feral, they could soften up those guards for us. Then again, they might also attack us. Let's take those turrets out of the equation. Gotcha.
thing was so big. You guys were amazing. Anyway, you should head through the workshop next. That's the direct way out. There's a rat in the system. I want this rat caught. Double the rations for anyone that does it. If that engine has a charged core, it might explode. When is that suit gonna be finished? I'm gonna need it when we do the next job. Don't rush me. You want it to malfunction and fry while you're inside. I thought you were a professional. Looks like you've got loads of options. I need to check out that feed again. Hey, got a message about someone messing with the security system. It's probably just acting up. That thing's glitchy as heck. Looks like you've got loads of options. Sid, can you fire up that engine? Let's blow them up. Ugh, that's gonna hurt. <laughs> 